Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Rad for Tarot and this is going to be our daily tarot reading <coughs> June 11th, 2018. So uh, this is going to be a four card spread, the first one that is showing up the topic for the day here. The second one it's uh, expressing up <coughs> what we should restrain ourselves from all the negativity of the particular day. Uh, the third card shows up the positivity or the, our intentions, what kind of intentions we need to put, uh, put behind <clears throat> that particular day. And last but not least, we do have um, the final outcome or how the day is going to benefit us in a long run. So the first card here, which is showing up the topic of that day, we do have the Ace of Wands. And Ace of Wands is a very positive card of establishing uh, new enterprises for our behalf. Uh, for example, we could start a, a new business, we could start new projects, or we could start dating new people. Everything that we can initiate to invite newness into our life is going to benefit us during that particular day because the Ace of uh, the Ace of Wands is um, uh, kind of observed as the spark of inspiration. That day will present us that spark, or in other words, the enterprise we need in order to make our life much more interesting than it is right now. I uh, we can and should act upon it so we can make uh, our daily routine much more thrilling than it, than, it, than it is right now and we can make our time running pleasant in a much more greater scale. Also for some of us the Ace of Wands does point that at that particular day we are going to receive the means necessary to reach a resolution of a certain issue of ours. Then the uh, negativity of the day or the things we shouldn't do that will be the Queen of Wands and uh, this particular card points that when we are about to embark that enterprise we should not rely on anybody's help especially on that particular woman here. Why? Because she is kind of um, a surreptitious in a sense that there is always something behind uh, behind her her intentions all right so she can point you into the right direction but there will be always something in for her as well so she will utilize some of your um some of your efforts and capabilities was the word I was searching for. So she will utilize some of your capabilities in order to push her own things through. Also you need to know that that woman is very um <clears throat> bruising alright and she also does does not handle uh, denial very well so it's in another words if you start to oppose her uh, you may expect that you are gonna have troubles and problems very uh, vengeful person as well now the ones uh, the court cards they they don't handle disappointments and uh, denials very well and they seek for a, a way to to return back you know the poignant the poignant experience in in this case uh, in, uh, if you you know denier or you are kind of like you know first invest and afterwards you decide to withdraw uh, she will try to find a way to uh, return back the favor in a negative way. That being said, um, it is uh, very, it will be productive here during that particular day to just keep that new enterprise for yourself and act upon it completely alone because this new inspiration, it is your inspiration, it is not someone else's inspiration. And then we do have the positivity, how you should act upon that particular um, enterprise and with the uh, nine of pentacles it does look like another by the way card of singularity nine of pentacles in the original reader wait as you know is a uh, a woman holding a um, <clears throat> Uh, a bird in in her hand of uh, in her hand very confident walking in a garden which represents the fruits of her life uh, of her labor that being said you should embark that new enterprise with a great amount of confidence and also uh, you know with uh, kind of like um, armed with your previous experience and not the poignant experience but the experience which you have from the success you have achieved in your previous projects in your previous relationships just to give you an example if it is about a relationship and you, um, <clears throat> you know, 
you start dating someone in that particular day or it just you meet someone in that particular day you should not be shy guys you should not be uh, someone who's trained themselves from the company you should not think the less of you just on the contrary you need to try to shine with all of your uh, positive lights and you need to uh, kind of like it's not even bruising yourself upon the situation but more like suffusing the situation with your radiance if I may uh, if I may say it that way and in case it regards to career here there is nothing um, baffling with this couple of cards and that one it does look like that you will be much more capable than a, a competition this is what these cards are pointing to me at least and that's why the promotion will be given to you if you act upon the enterprise given uh, given to you in this particular day and the last card shows the positive aspect in the long run in case you keep those couple of conditions that will be the nine of swords and in a positive aspect the nine of swords this point that you will be able to overcome severe fears of yours probably uh, mm, uh, the shyness of uh, or the doubts in one's uh, in, in one's capability is it's a great fear you know that is a fear of failure you will become much more confident you will become much more um how can I place it? you will become uh, much more reliant on uh, on your soul on yourself or on your personal strengths excuse me you will become much more independable and also much more responsible because the nine of swords is also taking responsibilities for one actions and uh, just for a conclusion that they could be a prerequisite of a, a great jump moving on forward especially career wise by looking at these cards because it, you will be able to present yourself not just very capable but also someone who is very who can be very responsible for the growth not only of of the company but of themselves because the growth of the company will be your personal growth either and same goes for one relationship so that is a, a big day and I can advise you to grab that enterprise and just nurture it nourish it and uh, just act upon it so with that being said this was your daily tarot reading for June 11 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video Rod signing out now see you next time bye